But guess what? The muscle memory. Muscle memory is no joke, guys. The more the better, right? <laughs> hair tips, how I keep my hair healthy. Guess what? They just arrived. Great job. Great job. You'll be getting also an updated version of my makeup. Sometimes you just gotta shine. And of course I did everything wrong. <sighs> what to do? Another random vlog. What's up guys? Started my day strong. So I also kind of started it strong because I also decided on the middle of everything, film the video, film the vlog because I haven't done the vlog in so long. And you're like all, oh my God, why did you stop doing vlogs? Honestly, like I just wanted to have this break where I just replenish my energy. You know what I mean? But talking about energy, I'm actually really drained now because I worked out today for two hours in the morning. I did a weight workout and then, and then, I went to play paddle for an hour so I am kind of restarted my paddle lessons again because I've been taking a break from that one haven't played since August so it's kind of nice to go back to it and I also was so worried that I'm not gonna remember how to play and I had to start from scratch you know this feeling where you like haven't done something in so long you think you completely forgot it but guess what the muscle memory muscle memory is no joke guys I felt like I didn't even take a break I like went right straight into it anyway it's great great feeling Feeling. Why am I just like walking around? Anyway, came back, had a salad. Oops, empty plates, you see. Also had a protein shake on my way from weight workout to paddle. Because I was like, I'm not gonna make it energetic to paddle if I'm not gonna have something. And protein shake felt like a good thing because it's like you can still run and not feeling like the food coming up. And then I made this salad that was arugula, corn, tomatoes, and mango and leftover of the chicken let me just close this laundry door because it's making the noise so currently i'm now uploading a video what i ate in the day i'm doing it on my floor as you see right next to the laundry Ooh, you're getting like real behind the scene next to the laundry because our router is in the laundry room so the internet's slightly a bit faster here so i'm really wanting to like get this done quickly anyway guys this video is like a random vlog basically another random vlog i'm having like emails today have to upload the work vlog i'm waiting for a response from a client about all the tags all the links everything filming another material for thursday because i have nothing to post and gonna do like get myself ready for a day you know so you'll be getting also an updated version of my makeup anyway guys let's go i just we just got back from the islands i still have like all these things stacked up here those the linen napkins that i ordered custom made you see and these for christmas guess what they just arrived great job great job great job with delivery but anyway it's gonna be for the next year vitamins right now because if I don't take them now I'll forget later so from new things I actually have to make a separate vlog for with all my like updated vitamins because I always change it up but from the reason that I added was this fatty acid 15 honestly this company sent me the product and I just decided to try it but I also read about fatty 15 and how it is crucial for strengthening the cells in your body and just like I don't know I just feel like I'm not maybe getting enough of fatty 15 because i don't really eat a lot of butter because so i do think it's contains in the butter <laughs> but anyway it is really great for supporting your cells i read it's great for metabolism so trying it out honestly just started it a few weeks ago so i don't see a major difference but one of the new things that i've been taking so i will give you my honest feedback once i complete the bottle i also feel like i never I never take vitamins on empty stomach because I feel so nauseous if I do. So in the morning, I usually wake up, I have my green juice with collagen powder. I told you I'm using this one by Aging Nature. And after I go to work out, you know, do my thing. And then I'm having like a late breakfast slash brunch or lunch, whatever you want to call it. And then I'm taking like the whole portion of my vitamins. And again, like take a note, I don't take it consistently throughout the year. Like I do a course of like multivitamins and then 
I stop and then after six months I like do it again I think it's not you know it's not worse to take the vitamins all the time if your body don't really need it also another thing that I'm gonna incorporate today is electrolytes because today I worked out for two hours and I lost quite a bit of water so I do feel a little dehydrated like I already arrived and I drank two bottles of water like this meanwhile I already drank one bottle uh, during workout so it's been one and a half liter and it's not even noon yet so I feel like this is needed honestly I'm stealing it from my husband but he's going to this physician and he recommended him this powder he said it's a great brand and good so for muscle recovery for electrolytes replenishment honestly tastes artificial but I think it's due to the fact that there's stevia and maybe there's also flavors yeah naturally flavored if there is also BCAA which I think is good for muscles muscle recovery so I've been liking this one this one is extend it is blueberry lemonade flavor I usually take this kind of hiking, do you call it hiking bottle? And I just fill it up full and just add a one scoop of the powder and I sip it throughout the day. I don't like to drink it at once because honestly it like makes me a little a little sick if I do, especially because I just ate. I'm putting filtered water. Honestly, I started to use more and more filtered water, especially at home when I like I don't have need of like grabbing a bottle. So I have this aqua gear kind of pot, super easy to use. The only thing you have to change once a month, I do it once a month, a filter that's inside. So put one scoop, this powder. that part came out of a shower honestly a little bit sad because i got this new silk washable silk pajama which you're supposed to like wash which i did and it's kind of deformed you see it's like strange shape and then i looked at the tag of course it was washable pajama but you have to like cold water gentle wash no dryer and of course i did everything wrong <sighs> what to do anyway getting ready i have certain minutes to get ready so you will get a real quick routine i washed my hair too because i was incredibly sweaty incredibly sweaty i'm not gonna do like my old skincare routine i just washed my face with antibacterial soap because i feel like when i sweat so much i need to like sterilize my face if it makes sense and i put also this toner which i'm trying out by fig one it's a balancing hydrating toner i've been loving this one it has like a lot acid and we'll also put face cream and We'll give you guys my promised makeup routine. I just feel like I'm always updating it because you know guys, I, I'm a makeup junkie. I love buying makeup. I love trying makeup. I love to discover makeup through like makeup artists. I have one makeup artist that I love because he is, as me, obsessed with trying new products. So every time he does my makeup, he gives me like new products to try and I always love it. It's incredible. I don't know how he manages to like pick such a right products for me. It's crazy putting my jewelry on. I always put my jewelry out, especially the earrings. No, I don't put all the jewelry out, especially like those bracelets, it's hard to take out. But for example, those hoops that I wear kind of now every day, at the beginning I felt like, okay, maybe it's too much. And I was like, I'm gonna wear it, why not? You know, sometimes you just gotta shine. Sometimes you just gotta go for it. So I'm putting this and I also like to, to take out all my small rings. I never take out my, well, my engagement ring because it makes me anxious to lose it, even at home. But I do take out like this little ones usually, my wedding band. I just feel like when I wash my hair or when I do my skincare, like things catch up on it, you know? Almost finished my electrolytes. Let's go, let's get the makeup on. Ooh, I also repurchased this Aman Avayu Parfum, which I actually run out of. It's actually, this parfum was included in my collection of parfums, which I posted maybe a year ago, but then I like ran out of it and forgot to repurchase it. And I also like, like to try new senses and use new senses. I like don't stick with one for a long time. I just like to switch it up. But this one, I really wanted to come back to it. And we were on vacation in Aman last week. And and I just saw it at the hotel store and I was like, okay, this is a sign, I'm getting it. Fun news, I actually just received a package that I've been waiting for, for a couple of days. 
because I did got the express version because I couldn't wait for it to get here. And it's actually a makeup product, how fun. So I'm gonna try it out. I actually already know because as I told you, I got it from a recommendation of a makeup artist when he was doing my makeup. So I kind of know what the product is, but I'm excited to show you. It's like an SPF base for face that you can use for day and night because it has pretty good coverage and the application is so easy to use. I'm getting my suction holder so I can put the camera in the right position for you guys and just do a chit chat video. Testers. I think it's a Korean cosmetic by the way and when it comes to skincare I do trust Koreans. They know what they're doing clearly. Okay. Okay, the camera is a little like wobbly, but we can work with that. <sighs> anyway, guys, what else we didn't chat about today? I feel like it needs to be like a cheaty chat video because we haven't catched up in forever. Putting the primer first. Dr. Sibach vitamin C. Oh, I didn't want to tell you. Oh, I wanted to tell you that. Can you believe I already applied for Allegra school for next year? Because due to the fact that people are moving to Miami from all over the country, the schools are slammed and I want to switch Allegra school school next year again not because I don't like the previous one I love the previous one but the previous one is like a little bit more for like a little age meanwhile the next school is like a long term where she can go up to the high school I honestly would love her to stay in this little school for a couple more years but it is so hard to get to the school that I want her to end up in that we have to kind of go and apply for the kindergarten for the next year so that's kind of what i've been dealing this nowadays what else i mean honestly just like a very slow and start of the year kind of like lazy start of the year because it's always hard after the holiday to like i don't know just tune in into work i guess i mean i'm a person that works well under pressure i guess so you know when beginning of the year starts especially after all the holidays all the trips you just don't feel that pressure because nothing really happening to be honest but hopefully end of this month things are gonna be like picking up you know and i will feel inspired again so guys it comes in like a thing like this kind of like usual powder with a sponge and you have to input inside i think this is actually an extra thing let me see yeah oh wow that's a lot of product so basically you're just pressing it like this so the product comes out and then you are applying it all over your face. I put concealer, but honestly, I think that I could do it without the concealer, probably. And I love the fact that this one contains SPF. Let me see how much SPF. SPF 50. Oh, I love that. Usually, like, those type of products are only up to 30, but this one is 50. Even so, they say that there is no difference between 30 and 50, but the more the better, right? <laughs> That's just the human nature. I love the glow of this product so good. I guess I'm like looking in the mirror. It should be doing bare minimum today. I'm still gonna go around with the brush. I just like to like blend in those places where I think is uneven. A no habit. Let's do the blush. Oh, I also got this. I'm trying to understand what's the brand name. It's called M Cosmetic. Okay. So this one is lip cushion, tinted lip luminizer. Let's see how it looks. I already have a lip balm on, so it's gonna be a little bit more glossy probably than it should is. But hmm, it's a lot of pigment. Well, maybe not for the day, but actually maybe for the day if you use a little, little bit. I kind of love it. More color than I expected, but I think for evenings actually, exactly what I need. Look at this. I'm trying to like starting my year healthy even with like beauty routines I'm not using hair dryer unless I'm going out so only closer to the weekend so today is what Monday Tuesday so I'm not using hair dryer today just letting it air dry when people ask me for like hair tips how I keep my hair healthy and honestly like number one tip is not using all this like hair dryers hair tools which drastically burn your hair and honestly like my hair improves so much since like I stop active modeling years I have to say I still do a modeling job especially like last year kind of end up with quite a few modeling jobs and I booked for this year already three so I'm kind of excited a lot of mommy and me shoots but yeah 
if you don't have a need of doing it honestly at least I don't know how many times a week do you wash your hair I for example wash every other day but at least two times a week I air dry them they don't look as good as I wish them to look of course you know when you use a hair dryer they just look better but January is the month of health for me so I'm kind of moisturizing my hair giving them love and I promise you it's always paying off so moving on into into a blush quickly using this blush by milk color I'll try to find it guys I'll try to attach the link here but it's like a coral color and I love this one it's quite liquid so it's, it's very see-through which is nice for the day smile tap 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 sometimes I put too much blush actually like because I look at my picture and I was like oh okay and I don't use really powders during the day also put blush a little bit on the tip of my nose just to give myself a little bit of like this sunburn effect brows for the day i like to use this brow mascara i'm using this one by romanova makeup the shade adds blonde it's really great for my eyebrows i just love the color of it because i feel like it's really a perfect color for my face for my overall features it's not too dark it's not too like yellow or orange okay so last few steps using my favorite tom ford apal for the eyes i love this one it's just such a good like highlighting color i'm literally using it for highlighting the eyes it doesn't give any color to it it just really brightens it up and i feel like your eyes and your face instantly look fresher guys i literally have five minutes because i'm driving allegra to cooking class and her friend she has a little friend literally her best friend which is the daughter of my friend how great is this that i don't need to make new mom friends you know what i mean so it's very convenient and all we're hoping for with my friend casey that they're never gonna stop being friends and if they will we'll force them <laughs> It's funny because previous year they used to go together to school and, and then next year they literally separated them. I don't know why, but I think there is like a Montessori philosophy, you know, when they're also separating siblings because they were literally like two sisters. They wouldn't make friends with anyone, but just would stay the whole day together. So now they see each other only on after school classes, which is cooking class, which I'm taking them every Tuesday and ballet. It's funny like recently Allegra been resisting to go to ballet honestly like I'm not planning for her to be like a professional ballerina but I still want to like set a, an example of dedication of like not giving up so I don't know if that at this age is like essential to like pressure them to still going keep going or not so Monday she like didn't want to go so I told her okay fine you don't go but Wednesday you have to go you have to promise me and she said yes so let's see if she's gonna like follow through on Wednesday but it's been interesting if before before, like if I would tell her to go on something she wouldn't even like argue or think there is an option now she's already telling me that she doesn't want to go she's too tired la, la, la. even with school like sometimes she pretends she's sick or she's tired and you don't want to look like you don't believe her but in the same time she's such a good actress it's no joke it's no joke honestly okay guys this is my final look a very like cool bodysuit which is made of like I don't know what this material cotton but very thick cotton because we're having a winter in Miami actually it's gonna be a really cold weekend so we'll have a little winter fashion going on a pair of jeans and I'm gonna take this Ralph Lauren classic bag I honestly have been obsessed with this bag lately at first when I bought it I was like okay it's a classic piece is it too boring but now I'm like oh my god thank god I bought it it's such a good piece and it literally kind of fits the whole styles it's always easy to like put together with casual outfits even with dressy outfits like I showed on one of my Instagram posts and I'm gonna put those slides very simple outfit when you don't know what to wear just wear jeans and white top or black top you're always gonna look sleek and nice anyway guys oh also forgot to show you let's see on the daylight this makeup product you see how great is the skin looks and SPF even in there anyway guys I'm going Valeria is coming because he took my car today so he's coming I'm gonna pick up Allegra and taking her to cooking class okay guys it was nice having you again on my video on this vlog I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed filming it I'll see you next time ciao